Next up on the track, the women's 200 metres T64 final. Ermgard Ben Suzanne holds the world record and the Paralympic record. The Paralympic record she set in the heats, and Marlene Van Ganswinkel holds the T64 record that she also set here in Tokyo earlier today. Anna Stephen of New Zealand, 21 years of age on her Paralympic Games debut. She was seventh at the last World Championships in 2019 in this event. Great day for her. Maria Tietze of Germany will go in lane nine and play football in Germany prior to her accident in 2015. Instead, a personal best in her heat. Beatrice Hatz of the United States. She was fifth back in 2019. Sydney Barter, the second of the United States athletes taking part. She set a new area record in her heat. There are two athletes from the Netherlands. First up, it's Kimberly Alcameda, a lifetime best in her heat. Needs no introduction. Ermgard Ben Suzanne, the only T44 classified athlete going in the field, holds the world and Paralympic record, which she set right here with that Paralympic record. Papa Constantinou of Canada, disqualified in 2016. And Van Ganswinkel, who holds the Paralympic record in the T64 category. So a field of eight. With just one T44 that goes in the field. T44 competing without a prosthesis, while the T64s are lower limbs competing with a prosthesis. Van Genswinkel will be one of the favourites. She's the reigning European champion. Yemga Ben Suzanne, she's the reigning world champion from Dubai in 2019. Two Germans going. Maria Tietze, the first of them, will go from lane nine. Sydney Barter, who set the North American record in the heat. Ben Suzanne, who holds that world and Paralympic record. Van Ganswinkel, the Paralympic record holder in the T64. Papa Constantinou of Canada. Alcameda of the Netherlands, the second of the Dutch. Beatrice Hatz of the United States goes in lane three. And Anna Steven, looking like she's enjoying the experience from New Zealand will go in lane two. And why wouldn't she? Well, the rain's still falling here On your mark. at the National Stadium. Ever so lightly. As Van Ganswinkel gets herself up for it. So Ben Suzanne, the T44 competing without a lower leg prosthesis. The rest all T64s with a lower leg prosthesis. And away they go, and Van Ganswinkel and Ben Suzanne get out really quickly. Ben Suzanne is out the fastest of all, but looking really good on the inside is Marlene Van Ganswinkel as they round up into the last 100 metres. It's Marlene Van Ganswinkel who leads it at the moment from Ben Suzanne on the outside. And across on the inside, it's the second of the Dutch athletes, Alcameda. It's Ben Suzanne, but out in front, it's Van Ganswinkel. Can she hold on? Marlene Van Ganswinkel gets it. A new Paralympic record for the T64 category. Ben Suzanne 
takes his silver medal and it is Kimberly Alcameda of the Netherlands who makes it a Dutch 1-3. Well, Van Ganswinkel looked really strong as she rounded into the last 100 metres. She's the double European champion in 2018 and most recently in Bidigosh in 21. Season best in her heat. She already owned the Paralympic record in the T64 category. She's better that. Constantinou almost for Canada picked up that bronze medal, but she couldn't quite get to Alcameda. It's the Dutch who pick up a gold and bronze medal, and Ben Suzanne of Germany takes a silver. 26.22, the ratified time for Marlene Van Ganswinkel as she gets the congratulations from her fellow Dutch athlete who picked up a medal as well. Look at that. Well, they're a small team, are the Dutch, but they're a team who work really well together. Marlene Van Ganswinkel, 26. 0.22 and a new Paralympic record. Very close to a world record as well. But this is all about the medals today and two of them going to the Netherlands from this 200 metre final. It looked like Ben Suzanne quick out of the blocks as we'd expect for the athlete competing in the T44. But then coming off that bend, Van Ganserwinkel found her stride and she just continued to eat away at the field and open up that gap. A strong battle back from Imgad Ben Susan to win the silver. But Kimberly Elkamedi holding off a late charge coming from the Canadian on her right hand side to make it a 1-3 for the Netherlands. Well she trains with Fleur Young who we've already seen pick up gold at these championships in the long jump. They train under Guido Bonson. And she studied human movement studies. Quite apt indeed for someone who moves that quickly. Well, the rain might be bucketing down now here at the Tokyo National Stadium, but she doesn't care. Marlene Van Ganserwinkel, she has a new Paralympic record of 26.22 seconds. I thought Ben Suzanne had looked like she was going to pick her up as Van Ganserwinkel there came into the last 50 or so metres. And there was almost a stumble there from Ben Suzanne. But it was Van Ganserwinkel who just held off her German competitor. She suffered from a bit of burnout late in 2019. She'll be glad she's back and running like that. And so will all the Dutch because she's picked up a gold medal for the Netherlands. So confirmation of the result, Marlene van Ganserwinkel with the gold medal, a Paralympic record time. Ermgard Ben Suzanne, the T44 category, taking the silver. And Kimberly Alcameda, also of the Netherlands, taking the bronze. <laughs>